Hello future engineers, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're still new to my channel and you like what I'm doing, please don't forget to share my videos to your friends and to your friends' friends. To your younger brothers and sisters who would want to take up engineering in the future. And to your relatives. That's one way you can keep me going inspired and refreshed. Now, if you find my videos interesting and important to your studies, also, please don't forget to subscribe. Hello, students, subscribers, viewers, and future engineers. Here is another very important video in Engineers in Progress. Consider the problems and this, the videos in this play, playlist as the most important because your future in engineering uh, life will depend on your background in mathematics. So, though some problems here are simple, this will help you slowly but surely make you think differently. And I hope though this basic math in algebra for example will help you enhance your skills in mathematics especially the thinking skills analytical skills so i hope that you consider problems here videos here the most important especially for those who are still in high school or preparing for their engineering uh, life. So we have now another type of problems on age and this would be the principles. If X is the person's present age, then 1. X minus 4 was his or her age 4 years ago. X plus 5 will be his or her age in 5 years or 5 years from now or 5 years hence. Those will be the statement uh, representing this uh, expression for the age 5 years or 5 years from now or 5 years hence. Then X plus M will be his or her age in M years or M years from now or M years hence. And the difference in ages between two persons mentioned or involved is constant so there's no uh, other condition here the two persons should be alive always at the time and unless specified in the problem so here is the first uh, problem it is sometimes uh, easy to analyze if you tabulate the solution would be in tabulated form but it is also uh, good if you just present the solution in a manner usual manner in algebra after translating the English statement to algebra so Floyd is three years older than his sister Mel. In seven years, he will be six sevenths of his age. How old is Floyd? So I'll present the solution in this tabulated forms. Form there are two persons, Floyd and Mel. Their present ages for Floyd I'll call it F, and for Mel supposedly M, but expressing M in terms of Floyd's age because Floyd is three years older than his sister Mel so Mel is younger than Floyd so therefore Mel's age would be Floyd's age minus three so I hope that you can follow then the future age which is specifically in seven years Floyd will be F plus seven by the principle there and Mel would be F minus 3, present age plus 7. And if we simplify this, that's F plus 4. Then from this statement, she will be 6 sevenths of his age, meaning to say Mel's age in 7 years, which is F plus 4, 
is six seven of Floyd's age in seven years also. So six seven of F plus seven. So Mel's age in seven years, F plus four, is equal to six over seven of Floyd's age in seven years. So F six over seven of F plus seven. Cross multiply seven F plus seven times four twenty eight equals distribute six F plus forty two. 7f minus 6f is f, and 42 minus 28 is 14. Therefore, Floyd's present age is 14 years old. Problem 2. Bianca is twice as old as Payo or Peo, and Maggie is twice as old as Bianca. In 10 years, their combined ages will be 58. So, how old is Bianca now? So, there are three persons mentioned involved here. Bianca, Payo, and Maggie. So, present age, we'll call Bianca's present age as B. Because Bianca is twice as old as Payo, that means B is two times P. Therefore, if P is Payo's age, in terms of Bianca's age, it is one half of Bianca because Bianca's age B is two times P, so P is B over two. And Maggie, which is M supposedly, is twice as old as Bianca, so it is clear it is two times B. So we, we have expressed present ages of these three persons in terms of Bianca's present age. So Bianca B, Payo B over 2, Maggie 2 times B. Then in 10 years, Bianca will be B plus 10, Payo will be B plus B over 2 plus 10, and Maggie would be 2B plus 10. Their combined ages will be 58. So meaning to say these ages here in 10 years, adding them would be 58. So B plus B over 2 plus 2B, that would be 3.5B. And 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 30 is equal to 58. So 58 minus 30 is 28. And 28 divided by 3.5 is 8. Therefore, therefore, Bianca's present age is 8 years old. So I just uh, write the solution. Anyway, I explain it in order to shorten the video so that it's easy for me to upload the video in YouTube. Then for problem three, four years ago, the sum of the ages of A and B was 45. Six years from now, twice B's age will be 28 more than A's age by then. How old is A now? So there are two persons, A and B, their past age which, which which was four years ago would be if present age of A is A and that of B is B and four years ago A was A minus 4 B was B minus 4 and it is mentioned here that four years ago the sum of the ages of A and B was 45 so we need to say if we add these ages A plus B minus 8 equals 45 so a plus b equals 53 call that equation one then six years from now so a will be a plus six in six years and b would be b, b plus six and it is mentioned here twice b's age will be 28 years more than a's age by then so two times b plus six that's the translation 2 times b plus 6 twice b's age in 6 years so 2 times b plus 6 will be 28 years more than a's age by then so we have a plus 6 plus 28 28 more than a's age in 6 years so that's the translation and the interpretation so expand 2b plus 12 equals a 6 plus 8, 34. So that means uh, 
B, divide everything by 2, is A over 2. 34 minus 12 is 22. 22 over 2 is 11. So B is A over 2 plus 11. Substitute in equation 1. So A plus B and B is A over 2 plus 11 equals 53. So A plus A over 2 is 1.5A. 53 minus 11 is 42. So A is 42 over 1.5. That's why A is 28 years old. That's the present age of A. And finally, problem 4. Mang Andoy has lived one-fourth of his life as a boy, one-fifth as a youth, one-third as a man, and has spent 13 years in his that age. How old is he? So, we will call A as, the, as Mang Andoy's present age. Then we we'll just go along, read along this line and interpret as we move on. So he has lived one fourth of his life as a boy, so one fourth of A, then one fifth as a youth plus one fifth of A, one third as a man plus one third of A, and has spent thir thirteen years in his that age. So plus thirteen. Then we will equate it. We will equate it to Mang Andoy's age, which is a present age, or this may be the age when Mang Andoy died. So the LCD is four times five times three, so that's sixty. Multiply everything by 60. 60 over 4 is 15 times A, so 15A. 60 over 5 is 12, so 12A. 60 over 3 is 20, so 20A. Then 60 times 13 is 780. Then 60 times A is 60A. 780 is 13 times 60. And 60A minus 15A minus 12A minus 20A is 13 a. Therefore, we can cancel 13. We can solve A. A is 60 years old. So that's it for this video.